today's video is going to be my Jordan collection video and I've wanted to film this video for ages well in fact I have filmed this video like five or six times but each time there was either something wrong or I had ordered a new pair of Jordans and it just got too messy to edit all of them in so I thought I would just film them all now that all of them have arrived and I've got like a decent amount to show you guys so um yeah i'm going to get straight into it um first of all for those of you guys who have been watching me for a long time you might remember these jordans over here and these are the first ever pair of jordans that i ever had and as you can see they are completely battered like they are just oh they were well loved at the time i didn't really know anything about trainers i didn't know that they were fake trainers i just kind of saw them on ebay and i thought they looked really nice and i bought them so in honesty, I don't know if these are real or fake, but these are, are supposed to be Jordan piston somethings in grade school size. But again, it came with no box. It just came like packaged just like this. So I have no clue. But um, yeah, I definitely needed a new pair of Jordans because as you can see, the only ones I had were really battered and talking. Um, for anybody who wants these and you want to like do like a project on them, maybe try and fix them up, practice painting on them or whatever you guys want to do, just send me a message or email me. My links will be down below and you can have these. I'll ship these out to you um, anywhere in the world but yeah these are my first pairs so these are kind of retired and now I'm going to show you all the new or the fresh pairs that I'm actually looking after now because I know how to look after my shoes better but yeah I'm going to just get straight into it so as you guys saw my first pair that I ever got were battered so I really needed a new pair of sixes and these actually came today I ordered these along with most of my Jordans from eBay and these are the um, infrared sixes and these are like my favorite sixes of all time like I love sixes they're probably my favorite um my favorite style of Jordan but I think these are my favorite type um my favorite colorway sorry and these are just so so nice I'll show you the other pair as well and this should be a try on video so I'll put a clip somewhere of me wearing it so you can see what it looks like on feet and this is what they look like they're so nice and vibrant the only thing I don't like about these is that on the grade school pair they don't have the 3m um, which is basically the reflective stuff that is like on these little holes that make it like glow in the dark kind of um, the grade school pair don't have those and a lot of people complained about that and I can see why it's a shame but you know that's just how it is and the bottoms of them look like this and all my Jordans are in grade school sizes because I wear a size 6 and yeah that is the first pair so the second pair of Jordans I want to show you guys are my um, gamma blues and these are so lovely this is what they look like um i wanted these shoes for ages like when i was in school i wanted these but i didn't know anything about how much they cost i didn't know how to get them i just saw them online one day and i wanted them but i didn't even have any money at the time because i was in school so i could never have afforded them anyway um but someone was selling them on ebay for 60 pounds so i was just like mm. so i had to get them because it's just such a good deal to pass up and i did loads of research on them so i know that all of my jordans are authentic i researched for like ages and um yeah this is what they look like at the back they have the kiddie shoe trees in there and i've taken out the insoles because um i'm a size six and these are a five and a half um so they're a tiny bit too small but when i take out the insoles it's it's all right so that's just what i did you guys should definitely check out on ebay if you want to like buy anything um trainers whatever it could be clothes because it's just like such a good place to get good deals um a lot of time it's because people are just looking for quick money and they just want to get rid of their stuff and they don't really care that they're making a loss so that's obviously going to be good for the buyer so definitely check ebay out if you're looking for any good deals so the next pair of jordans that i have are my um jordan six lows and i can't remember the name of them but i think they're called chrome something i'll put them in the description down below because i'm so bad at remembering names but these are just so nice i love them so much i love the fact that they're low because you can wear them with like um, skinny jeans like crop jeans and you don't have to worry about like it rolling over or it getting all bunched up because they're low so um yeah i love them these do actually come with lace locks but the person i bought them from had taken them off um, but they sent them to me in the box and they're just like this they're silver and they've got like a little black jump man on there somewhere these are probably the cheapest pair of jordans that i got um the person was selling them for like 50 pounds but then i asked um I did the best offer for 40 and she accepted it and then I had a £10 eBay voucher so I got them for like 35 including shipping all together which is amazing because people are selling these on eBay for like £200. I don't know why but they are so yeah this is what the bottom looks like as well. I haven't worn these out yet but I definitely will be wearing them in the summer probably with some shorts or like I said some hot jeans. So the next pair that I have are oh, oh my gosh these are like these are just the most amazing shoes. This is what they look like. These are the um 
what are they called? They're called aqua something. I can't even remember what they say. I think they're called turbo green um, low. I don't know. I'll put them down in the description as I said before, but I love these so much. I first saw Karuche wearing these on Instagram years ago and I loved them when I saw them on her, but by then like they were already sold out so I couldn't get them. And um, I don't know, I think these might have only come out in grade school sizes. I think these were made for like girls. I don't, I could be wrong, but that's what I think. So I think you could only get them in small sizes, but um, these just look so good on, like they're so nice. I haven't worn them out yet because um, it's raining so much in England at the moment, even though we're in May. Yeah, so when it gets hotter, I definitely will bring these out and wear them probably with like shorts or something, because they're just so cute and they're just like, oh, I just love them so much. And I actually got these for 55 pounds altogether. I did a best offer for 55, for 50 pounds and paid five pound shipping. Um, and it's probably like one of my favorite deals that I got because people are selling these for stupid amounts because you can't like get these anywhere. So yeah, the next pair of Jordans that I have, what are these? These are my um, Jordan 11 72 tens and oh, I love them so much. I just like the fact that they're simple and they're black. It just looks so nice on and just so effortless and I love them. Um, one tip for you guys to spot fakes of these, if you're in grade school sizes, then this bit here should be really like close together. On the adult sizes, they're actually quite like spaced out, but on the, the kiddie ones, they just come like this. I don't know why, but um, that's just one tip for you guys. And a lot of time, there's always like a tiny difference between the grade school and the adult sizes so check out the difference and then when you're looking on ebay you'll be able to spot which ones are fake because most of the fake sellers they make grade school sizes the same as adult sizes so that's already going to be like a red flag and this is both of them together my next pair i actually bought them full price um, online i got them from end um, and these are the black cat 13s i believe these retailed for 89 pounds but i had to pay like two pounds like shipping i don't know why they didn't just give it for free but uh, i paid like 91 pounds something in total and when i first saw these i thought they were really ugly but when i saw them on feet i just thought it just made it look so much nicer and one thing i love about these trainers is that all these things here sort of reflect in the um when it's night so it stands out and it's just amazing and i'll try and put a clip somewhere of it online glowing so you guys can see what on earth i'm talking about um and it also has like this green thing here that like goes from orange to green and from what i read it's supposed to like resemble the cat eye um which i think is a really cool feature and there's like this green ball at the bottom with the jordan um logo the jumpman logo on there as well and so last but not least these are probably my favorite pair of um 11s that i have these are the jordan space jams and my boyfriend actually showed me these and he couldn't end up getting them because he didn't get them on time because they had sold out but thankfully i managed to get myself a pair i got these for 80 pounds on ebay so i actually got these below retail price i think the retail price for my size was 105 pounds so i got a good deal i was quite happy with them also my 72 tens i didn't mention but i got those for 75 pounds but my sister bought those for me for my birthday so i didn't actually pay for those but um yeah these were 80 pounds and you guys all know what these look like they're just such a nice colorway they're really really simple and they just look so nice on um i have worn them so they have got like a tiny bit of like dirt marks here which i need to scrub off I'm kind of slacking with cleaning my trainers but um yeah I'm gonna probably force my boyfriend to help me do it because he does it really good so these are my last pair of Jordans that I have I don't have any plans to buy any more for now I think seven pairs are enough for me at the moment especially seeing as I've only worn like three of them I do have quite a few other pairs that I want I do want the bread 11s that everybody has but I can't find those anywhere I want a few 12s I've got quite a few other ones that I want to buy but if I don't see them for an amazing deal then I won't bother because I'm not trying to um, spend all my money so yeah again if you guys want those Jordans that I showed you in the beginning these battered things then again let me know because I think I'm probably going to just throw them away so just let me know if you want them and I'll ship them out to you but yeah thank you so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this video it's really fun making other videos than just hair reviews so hopefully you guys enjoyed it um, if you did please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and I'll see you all in my next video bye